This is a photograph of two 10-year-old girls, and it was taken in 1969. Uh, they weren't trans children. And as soon as you put the word trans together with the word child, of course, it politicizes the child and allows us to treat that child as an adult. The word trans is heard, and the word child uh, is not heard. It's hidden. Um, so back in the 60s and 70s, the mother of these two girls did buy them clothes from the boys' section of the Littlewoods catalogue uh, and otherwise just didn't pay any attention to this uh, because she knew they were children. And I was thinking about the change from the 60s and 70s to now. What's changed uh, within the culture that now these two 10-year-old girls would probably be called trans boys. So um, what happened to these two girls? They had a terrible time through puberty and adolescence. They fought against becoming women. They had all the eating disorders, a bit of self-harm. And this went on right through their 20s for both of them. And then they both married and became mothers and came to terms with being, woman, with being women, um, even feel, feeling proud of being uh, women. Um, still rebels. <laughs> I know now, and it took me many years to unpick this, but I know now what I was rebelling against then in not wanting to become a woman. Um, it wasn't about not wanting to be a woman, but it was about not wanting to be what society told me a woman was. And there's a big difference there. 